Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophynet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Death March difficulty. We're still playing the Blood and Wine DLC and well, I was planning to continue on with the main quest today, uh, the main quest of the DLC, that is. But um, I was, I kept wondering what would happen if you uh, actually won the tournament, the tourney, and maybe even did something different when dealing with Vivian in the uh, A Warble of a Smitten Knight quest. And uh, well, I went back to an older save file I still had. I didn't even have the uh, Grandmaster Wolven gear there yet. And uh, well, you can see the result here in a minute because I'm going to show you right now. So enjoy! Like a lover ghostly grasping, but one fair teeth, girls half strewn, which joyous victory Bam. and bit faster than before. I just kicked that guy's ass. Scoundrel! And he's up! We the thunder's roar, whose pounds the ground. No legion of traumas could make such a sound. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. Okay. So close. Will he last? Into yes, fuck off. Yes, I won. So welcome back. We just won the horse race. I think I missed one dummy. So that's uh the only one I missed. So uh, let's go further. We shall feast from eve till dawn's first light. The finest of wine and food shall be served if you've blood in your veins. Come collect what's deserved. Okay then. Oh, the look at that! Here, your it's price. a fancy prize. With your crest. Thank you, Vivian. Many thanks. By the way, my maid saw a man with white hair sneak out of my tent. Did you know who it might have been? No. Uh. That was us. How juvenile. How juvenile, yes indeed. Sorry, Lady Vivian. Congratulations on your win. In stellar style, no less. Ah, I no longer regret I was not able to participate. 
Almost. We must drink to this. Come with me to the feast. We shall await Vivian together. So from now on, it probably will be the same. Did you learn anything? Yeah. So we're back with Guillaume after then we speak, confronted man. Vivian and found out that out she's a, a bird woman. What ails her? She asked me um, to talk about it. And just to see, I still stand by my Perhaps original decision to not to tell him, but I want to see what happens if you do tell him now that we have the chance. So, uh, a powerful curse afflicts her. We were both right, actually. It is a curse. One that's transforming Vivian into a bird. Her condition's getting worse. Gods! A curse that is a worse affliction than disease. What now? Can you help her? You're not really smart, are you? I'll try if she asks me. Significant risks involved, though. Shortening her life to about another seven years included. What? This is not what we agreed. Um, we're trying to help her, not you, remember? Um, it's all up to Vivian. It doesn't matter what we agreed. It's Vivian's decision. She can either try it or not. Of course. But I could not live in the knowledge it was I who brought an ill fate down upon her. It's not your Heard fault that she wants her curse work. cured. Curse could be lifted via her reflection, say in a pool of water. Thing is, we'd need someone who'd willingly assume the burden of the curse. So that's what I Take thought would happen. You mean, become a bird themselves? Theoretically. So Guillaume. See, curse grows weaker once it's transferred. Might end up as just an appetite for seeds and worms. All outcomes are on the table, though. Death included. I am prepared to sacrifice. Give my life for her. Just as King Friedank's knight did for the beautiful Queen Sarah. Yeah, unless, except you don't really know her. Are you prepared her. to swallow bugs for the rest of your life? <laughs> yes. <laughs> that the, Which the method sound, do you believe uh, to be best for Vivian? Don't know yet. Good. But you have some notion, have you not? Do not tell me you seriously consider drastically shortening her life when I stand prepared to shoulder the burden. It's uh, her decision. Uh, we did the egg ritual before, so I still stand by that because she wanted to have it that way because she didn't want anyone else to bear that curse. But just to see what happens, we should try the water method. Method using a pool of water is better poses no threat to Vivian. Naturally. Y you must know you can count on me. I shall bear it all. But Vivian, I fear she might be too proud to agree to such a thing. She Only is. I mean, good reason. Contest. Talk to her. She could agree. I'm counting on you, Witcher. And I'm content we finally know something. What now? We know all, so you need not see the tourney through. You could withdraw. True, well, I shall get an earful from the Herald should you fail to show for the last contest. But it's nothing I can't handle. So, what will it be? So now he's actually agreeable to the idea to uh, stop competing in the tourney. But of course, I went back to uh, actually win the tourney. So, uh, want to finish the tourney? I don't back out of anything. I'll take part in the last skirmish. Besides, Vivian will be busy till the tourney's end. Indeed. In that case, you must meet the other knights of your team. They await near the arena's entrance by the training ground. Got it. Thanks. Okay, Palmerin. That's enough of that. Come on, buddy. There we go. Yes. Okay, that's the final task. Words Jesus Christ, so that took me a while. For showing such verve, each knight was victor. Yet in tourneys as in life, but one champion may reign. Today he is the one, praised be his name. He felt a whole host slew the most. To Geralt of Rivia, yes. the strength of Finally. He sailed through all trials, each test he passed with ease. But now awaits the last. Will it bring him to his knees? Hopefully or not. Where the Gorgon, who on this ground last won, shall spar him for the title, and the day is done. To the tired remainder, we salute your endeavors. Return to your wives, your loves, your whomevers. Okay, let's do this.
Mr. Mountain. Okay then. Here we go. It is time. Step into the arena. Should you suffer grievous harm during combat, have you any last wishes? Any missives you wish passed to your loved ones? Uh, n no, because I'm, I'm, I'm not going to die. The Witcher of Rifia, Geralt his name. Though aged be his visage, do not disdain. His locks true are white, but he was born to fight. Oh, I'm scared. Now entering the grounds, a titan of infamy. Gregoire de Gorgon, victor of last is Tony. He is going to kick I my wish ass. Both combatants good fortune and fame. Oh, God. Can I? Can I? Oh, I can't fix my sword. This the crowns, the titans is going to be a problem. And spry as wolves hunting hares. I can't use my signs. Mesdames et messieurs, our victor and champion, the Antichrist. I'm guessing I'm going to have to be faster than him. I am a lot faster than him. Oh! I think I'm gonna have to be careful with my strikes, just one. Just react to his attacks, dodge away and then strike. Or if he taunts me, I'm going to hit him all the while. Come on, buddy. Okay, that's it. That was actually a lot easier than that five-on-one fight before us. There we go, a night to remember. Fuck yeah! Ooh, a golden sword. I have the honor to decorate our grand champion. His vow he made upon his love for his heart's captor, and it was doubtless this vow that carried him to this splendid victory! He showed great courage, great strength, great composure. He fought nobly with honor, and thus rightfully deserves the title of this year's Champion of the Arena! Thank you, Vivian. I need to talk to you. Not now. We shall meet later in my tent. Mm -hmm. I have duties to attend to, as do you. Folk regard you. The least you should do is wave. I will. Smile and wave, Geralt. That's a nice sword. So back to Vivian herself and her curse. Let's see what happens if we uh, try the other method. Greetings, my lady. Have you decided? I have. I stand by all I have said. I wish to endanger no one and thus choose the method involving an egg. If it's to be the egg of an oriole, I know where to find one. There is a nest in my clearing. Might you explain the nature of the ritual? Its exact course? Sure. Well, we're gonna try well, something different. I think we should try the alternate method first. I was clear. It is out of the question. Let Too me late. Finish. Second method's less than reliable. To put it simply, might work, might not. But it will. I shall save you, oh lovely Vivian. Why are you oh. here, sir? <laughs> this is a private conversation. Um, Gil means well. He's not your foe. Got good intentions. You guessed right. He hired me. But only because he wanted to help you. Be not angry, my lady. You no longer bear this burden alone. I know all. You told him! I know a curse afflicts you. A curse which grows more severe by the day. I understand how you feel. 
My aunt, Contest de Lonful, once contracted a strange illness which ate away at her from the inside. She grew weaker by the day, the light fading from her eyes. I remember her saying the worst was not the pain, but losing mastery of her own body. She was so helpless. I fear you feel the same. The Witcher knows a way to lift the curse from you and let it rest on me. I wish to do this, to take it from you, Vivian. Why? Because, because he's completely you. fallen in love with you. I might have died in the arena. I sought to slay a Shailmar for you. But now I see the fool I was. Now I see how I risked my life for no purpose. Yet, with this, I can truly do something for you. I do not so romantic. to this horror on anyone. You saw how it looks, Witcher. I turn to you as one elder and hopefully one wiser as well. Do you think this a good idea? I still don't, but uh, worth a try. Worth a try, as I see it. Original curse fell on an unborn child. Doubt it'll take hold as strongly when transferred to a full-grown man. You've now heard the expert opinion. Let us do this together, Vivian. Very well. I was prepared to And die. she agrees. Thus, I am also prepared to attempt something mad. Now we must go to my pool in the woods, yes? Indeed, let's go. Everything's agreed, so no point wasting any more time. Let's go. Okay, so back at the hidden clearing, I'm really, really curious how this will pan out. Quickly gonna repair everything. There we go. What became of her? She passed on. Okay. She's interested a bit. No, no, Guillaume, stay back. Why am I punching it? Okay, thanks, Guillaume. So, mirror, mirror in the water. Is Guillaume gonna turn into a bird or not? Wow. I'm still amazed at the design. I mean, it's so cool. So, Guillaume, her eyes are up there. Yep. It is not too late. You may still change your mind. It will bring no shame. My mind is made up. My resolve is firm. If you can handle it, so will I. You are beautiful to me, even as you stand now. Well, that I didn't expect from Guillaume. Oh, that's clearly rubbish. <laughs> Shut your okay. eyes, both of you, and don't move. Okay. Guillaume? Yes, my love? If you become as I am now, I wish you to know shall not leave you. Picture yourselves reflected in a pool of water. Focus on that. There we go. Now, open your eyes. Damn. What the hell might have worked. happened? Were they both pulled into the water? Oh no, they exploded. So she's naked again. And he looks normal. Aside from the eyes. His eyes look a bit weird. Oh no. There they are. Uh, didn't think that would work. Honestly, didn't think this would work. Doubted anything would happen. 
Read about this ritual in grimoires. Descriptions all seemed dramatic, embellished. All stipulated a condition that seemed improbable. What condition was this? A real bond between those involved. True love. Okay. That was nice. How do you feel? How do you feel? In general. You feel it change, Guillaume? I was struck hard, as if by a battering ram, but now I, I feel not at all different. Apart from a slight itch on my skin. Are you certain it worked? Yes, something happened, definitely. And she's Must naked be behind us, by the way. This pond. Powerful magic at work here. Look at Vivian. So she's cured. But what's the catch? What now? Hmm. You get to live happily ever after, I suppose. Now? Now you get to live together. Happily ever after. Still, watch yourselves carefully. Notice any troubling symptoms. Find me. Naturally. I thank you, Garrett. Oh, and your payment. Oh, at last. I have so much to make up for. Balls to attend, distant lands to see. Free at last, as a bird. Ha! Huh? I find you droll. I had not noticed before. But you will not fly away without me. That remains to be seen, I think. But I too must thank you, Witcher. Don't mention it. You take care, both. So it does seem like the happier ending. Although, with the information we had, I still stand by my original decision. Um... But hey, that was actually pretty nice. I thought that would have been worse. Uh, so that's what happens if you win the tourney and... Oh, what are they doing? And uh, ask Guillaume for help. They seem fine. So yeah, that's that. So thank you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed that because I was really curious myself what would happen if things were different. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this little what if. So that's what happens if you involve Guillaume in the quest to uh, cure the curse that afflicts Vivian. It's a, a pretty much nicer ending than what we got, but I still stand by my decision. So uh, I didn't go back to that save file, so I didn't reset everything. So this is still the save file where we uh, lifted the curse using the Oriole Egg and uh, Guillaume was not together with Vivian just in case that something else was uh, has effect on the rest of the storyline regarding that side quest and we also didn't win the tourney in this uh, save file as well so um, with that done I think I'm gonna leave it at that it's a, a little episode a little what if episode so hope you guys enjoyed it uh, so thank you guys enormously for watching if you enjoyed the episode don't forget to like it right here on YouTube and if you haven't already don't forget to give it a thought to subscribe to my channel and uh, because I'd really appreciate any support you guys can give me. So with that said, uh, when we get back, we will continue the main quest. Wine is sacred. And I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.